Fuck, I forgot what I was, what I was, what I was, what I was going with that. Dang it. And I was talking about how... Uh, uh, you know, like how people shouldn't want me around due to an ulterior motive. Ah, crap. Oh, I don't even remember now. Fuck. But... Anyways. Again, it's like... I don't want to... Uh... Not bring anybody down. But again, it's, like I said, you know, like a lot of people don't think this, but talking about your situation actually makes you feel a lot better. Believe it or not. That'll do. Oh yeah, now I remember what I was gonna say. Now I remember. Uh, you know, it's like, you know, people are always telling me about how they want me to speak up how they want me to be able to uh, speak my mind freely and you know it's like if those same people watch this live stream or the video on YouTube whenever it goes up then they're probably gonna be you know it's like oh you know like he, you know he talks all the time you know, the only reason why he doesn't talk is because of me that's not the case the reason why I don't talk a whole lot around particular people is because most of the people I know talk a lot themselves. And you know, it's like, I don't want to interrupt them. And so it's like, I just don't talk a lot. It's like, that's the main reason why I don't talk a lot around particular people is because nine times out of ten, I don't get the chance to talk. It's not that I'm trying to be mean. Oh god. It's not that I'm trying to be mean to them in particular. Like strong Dang it. Whoa, where am I going? I'm going this way now, apparently. You know, it's just like, again, like I said, I don't want people to want to be around me just because of an ulterior motive. You know, like, just because they think they can gain something from me. Because then I'm not going to be happy. They're not going to be happy. Like, how's anybody going to be happy if they don't actually, truly, sincerely want me there, you know? Uh, DNA bomb, don't need that. Not yet, anyways. Yes, it is. Wait, yes. Punk. <laughs> I did a boost jump, but didn't make any noise, because I think it was still because of the exo rebooting. I mean, it's like, it's complicated. And it's like, it can just get really annoying when people only ever want you around 
because they want something from you or they think they can extort something from you. So, like, for example, like, if... Uh, I don't know, like, let's say... You know, I have a friend on Xbox Live and I'm not trying to name any names. I'm just, you know, I'm just giving an example. I'm not... You know, saying, implying, you know, like, oh, this person does cool. this. I'm just saying a friend as an example. I'm not saying a particular person. Anyways, like, let's just say, you know, like, a friend on Xbox Live. You know, like, on the one. And, like, you know, they said that they were going to do something with me, but then they don't say anything all day long. And then, let's say, as soon as I start broadcasting on Twitch, then all of a sudden they say something. But see, that's sending the message that the only reason why oh, no, they're contacting nice. me or want anything to do with me is because they want to be in the live stream. Not because they actually want to be with me, not because they actually want to spend time with me. And again, it's like, I don't like that because, like, nobody's going to be able to have a good time because... It's like, you know, I'm not actually wanted there. It's like, if they're having to force themselves to enjoy my company, then who the hell is going to be happy? For the scrap. You know, again, it's like, it's not that I'm trying to be mean to any particular person. I'm not naming any names because that wasn't implying anybody. I'm just, I was just giving that as an example. Well, at least it's just kennels. I don't know, they killed me that one time. Well, since I'm gonna get a full reload anyway, I might as well do that. Even though it's kind of pointless. Oh well. Good work, Mr. Drone. That was like completely silent. I don't know why. Anyways. Finally! Uh and it's a long, complicated story, and I don't know, some people may get it, some people might not get it. Right you now, it's like, that's another thing that I try to convey to people, it's like, whether certain people think it or not, uh, like, Everything you do and everything you say sends a message. Like, okay, for example, like, uh, a while back, almost a month ago, I made this thing on Minecraft where it's like, uh, oh god, where it's like, uh, you know how it's like, you know, whenever you get an achievement and it's like the achievement unlocked? Well, it's like, for someone I know, I'm not, you know, it's like, I'm not going to say who it is. I'm not even going to say their name so they can remain anonymous. But if they watch this, they're going to know who they are. But I made this thing on Minecraft where it's like the achievement unlocked. And it was their birthday, so it was like, achievement unlocked, and then it said, happy birthday. And then I put their gamer tag above it, and then their gamer score. See, so it's like, what message do you think that sends? You know, it's like, that's sending the message that, you know, that I really, really love and care about that person, because I spent the time to make that. You know, it's like, how many people do you know would spend the time to make something like that for someone? You know, it's like... Like I said, you know, it's like, the stuff that you say and do sends messages. And again, that sends... Oh, God. 
that sends the message about how much I truly love and care about that person. Because, I mean, why else would I spend two hours of my life making something like that? Oh, it didn't fucking work. Dang it. Oh my god. I thought that that would... Okay, like on the... Oh, I was dropping control. I thought that on the... You know, like, when you're actually doing the... Infection round, when you do that, that will make it so the zombies can't see you. But apparently when it's not an infection round, it doesn't do that. So I guess we found that out the hard way, and now I'm gonna end up having to do that again just to get the quarter riser done. Fuck. Uh. Oh well. Ah, my eye. Anyways. Uh. You know, it's like again, it's all just a huge, complicated thing. You know, uh, I don't know. I think that's about it on the subject, really. I probably could say more, but I can't really think of anything right now. Uh, Yeah, I can't really think of anything. Uh, so I guess that's it on that subject. I mean, I don't know. You know, again, it's a matter of... Don't whine about what you don't have. Be grateful for what you already have. So, you know, it's like, I'm still extremely grateful for the family and friends that I already have. You know, it's like, fuck, it's like, I wouldn't even be doing any of this if it weren't for my family and my friends. You know, it's like... My, you know, like, my parents... My older brother is my little brother. Um, all my friends. If if there was even a remote way of putting it into words just how much I love and care about you guys, I would say it right now. But there's just, as far as I know, there's just no fucking way to describe it. You know, it's like honestly, most of the times, I don't think I even deserve the family and friends that I have the most amazing and wonderful family and friends that I have in the world. And I couldn't be any more grateful for that. Like I said, I wouldn't be anywhere near where I am today if it weren't for my family and my friends. And I'm sure, I'm sure nobody really, you know, wanted this to turn into the whole sentimental thing. But, you know, again, same thing. It's like, you know, if you're this far into the video, which I'm hoping will actually be two hours now. Instead of split into like nine separate videos of 15 minutes. Because I actually verified my account. I learned how to do that. Uh, because yeah, if you actually get this far into the video, then, well, thank you for one. And... For two, it's like, if this isn't your type of thing, you know, like, cinema thing isn't your type of thing, then you can always watch something else, I guess. Uh, anyways. You know, it's like, I'm just really, really grateful for the family and friends that I have. And, again, it's like, I love them more than anybody will ever know, you know. I mean, again, like I said, the 
Minecraft thing that I made, I think that alone should say. Or I mean, you know, just everything I do, you know. You know, it's like I always try to show my family and friends just how much I truly do love and care about them. I mean, hell, the main reason why I'm even doing the whole Twitch and YouTube thing was because it was what my little brother wanted to do. Oh, you know what? I just realized that I wanted to keep everyone anonymous. Fuck! <laughs> well, there goes that plan. I mean, it's not like, you know, anybody's gonna put two and two together, you know, like, you know, like, everybody. I mean, you know, the people that I know are gonna be able to, obviously. But that's not what's important. You know, the main thing is, like I said... Well, I mean, yeah, I did want to try the Twitch and YouTube thing for myself. You know, it's like it's something that I've been thinking about for a while now. I just had absolutely no way of doing it, but now I actually do have a way of doing it. It would be a lot more efficient with an actual computer, but I don't have one. Not currently, at least. I have my phone, at least. Uh, But, yeah, I think that's about... The extent of it, you know. I just want, you know, my family and friends to know just how much I truly do love them and care about them and appreciate them every single day. And I don't want that to ever lose its meaning. And I think that's about it. And I would just like to take the moment that I am severely pissed off that I died that close to getting to Mark 25 with the quarter eyes. Now, I'm not really pissed off. I'm just, you know, joking around. Because obviously I wouldn't be laughing about it if I was pissed off. <laughs> I, just, I just find that funny. You know, it's like, I, I mean, I tried an idea. It didn't work, you know. It's not the end of the world. I can always just do it again. I mean, I have another three hours. Well, two hours and 59 minutes to be exact. Or would it be even more exact if you wanted to go into seconds, but I can't see that on my clock. So, that sucks. That means I'm gonna have to get Lilith and Decca's key card again! Damn it. That's the only part that I don't like about this, is getting Lilith and Decker's key card. That's the only parts that suck. Uh, damn it. That was why I was trying so hard, was because I didn't want to do it again. Uh, and I'm kind of hell-bent on just going right back into it instead of ending the stream and continuing it in another one. Because, I don't know. <laughs> Because, I mean, I kind of want to get something to eat so I can kind of focus a little more. Well, the main reason why I wasn't so fucking focused was because I was constantly talking and I was in a dire situation and I tried something stupid. I was so sure that that was going to work. I thought, you know, it's like I didn't think that that only applied in an in infection round. I did not know that. <laughs> you know? And it's like, and by the time I actually saw that, it was too late. But, I mean, again, you know, it's like, everybody makes mistakes, you know? I never said I was perfect or was the best at the game, nor am I trying to be. I'm just trying to have fun. Uh... I mean, that sucks. That means that I'm going to have to do all that shit again within the next three hours if I still want to get this done before it's been a week. Damn it. Again, this is why I was trying so fucking hard. It's because I was trying to avoid that. And I got to 15. I was doing so fucking good. 
I was doing so good, and then it all just came crashing down. And then I broke my crown. And I forgot the less rest of the lyrics. Man, that sucks a big pile of D. Dang it. That means that I've done a call in a rescue 12 times, and I'm gonna have to do it a 13th time. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Dang it. This is why I don't like pressure. It's hard to operate under. Because you try to do something and it doesn't fucking work. Because you're so stressed out that it's not going to work. Honestly, what I should have just done is I should have just went down the trash chute. Well, actually, no. I would say that I would have been perfectly fine. But then I probably would have been fucked. I mean, I guess what I could have done is I could have went through the trash chute, landed in the exit suit room, and then immediately went back through the trash chute and back to the start. I guess I could have done that. Unless that has a fucking cooldown time, too. <laughs> trash chutes with cooldown times. What is the future coming to? Ah, uh, that freaking sucks. And that game was actually two hours long, I think. Wait, can I still see a match summary? Yeah, it was two hours and five minutes long. So that's the longest game of Exozomies that I've done yet. And the only reason why that is, is because of trying to get the EM1 to March 25, which took forever. And then getting the... trying to get the Quarterizer to March 25, which also took forever. The only reason why doing the Mayhem, which made it to round 37, wasn't as long, because the Mayhem was just fucking riddling out the rounds. It was blowing through them like it was nothing, even when it wasn't fully upgraded. As me, it's like one of the rounds in the 30s lasted only four minutes. I mean, it went pretty fucking fast. Uh, Alright, so... Alright, to recap, the last uh, live stream that I did actually wasn't the longest one I did. It was actually shorter. I was surprised to see that, that it was actually shorter. I think it was like two hours and three minutes. All I know is it wasn't two hours and 15 minutes. It was shorter than that. This one, however, I know for a fucking fact is going to be longer because, again, the actual game itself was two hours and five minutes. And just, you know, like, the talking beforehand and then the talking now, that's probably going to be an additional, I don't know, like, 10 to 15 minutes. So, I can safely say that this is going to be the longest live stream that I've done yet. And again, nowhere near the last time I'm going to say that. Cause like it all depends on like, you know, like how far I get into the whole Twitch and YouTube thing. You know, like how much shit I start figuring out. Uh, I mean, I don't know. You know, it's like probably shouldn't have let it go on this long. <laughs> probably not. Uh. Probably not the best of ideas. Oh well. I mean... Well, okay. I don't know, you know? Or it's like, which one would be better? Because it's like you have nine videos of 15 minutes, or you have one video of, like, two and a half hours. You know, like, which one would be better? I mean, I guess it would be fine either way. Because, like, you know, you could watch them in increments. You know, like, you could watch one video and then watch another later. Or, like, you know, you could watch... The one giant video, I like you could pause it and then pick it up at another time. 
I mean, I don't know. <laughs> you know, it's like I, I haven't done it like this way before. I mean, I actually like it because it's super easy and efficient. Because all I have to do is is I, I just go to my phone. I go to Twitch on my phone. And then I just pick the export option. And then just wait until it tells me that the live stream has been put on YouTube. So, I mean, it's... It literally only takes the press of one button. Well, technically two. Maybe more if you want to change the title around or, you know, like, description and stuff. You know? So I guess it could be, like, up to, like, 50 buttons. <laughs> well, it's not really buttons since my phone's touchscreen. But honestly, who doesn't have a touchscreen phone? <laughs> I think all phones are touchscreen at this point. Ah, at this point. I swallowed and that hurt. Sometimes it hurts when you swallow in the middle of talking. Or like violently swallowing. Uh, but yeah. So, like I said, it's still going to be years of learning and experience. I'm obviously not going to be the best or the most sophisticated. You know, like my very first one I do. Nor am I trying to be. Like I said, it's a learning experience. Sooner or later, we'll learn. We'll get the book knowledge that we need. We'll get the education that we require. To rise to the challenge. And I gotta fucking stop referencing that song. <laughs> if anybody even knows what song I'm referencing. I'd be more disappointed in you people. I'm sorry. I'd be more disappointed in you people if you didn't know what reference, what song I was referencing. <clears throat> Anyways, I think it's about time for this live stream to end. I smell some kind of smoke. It smells like car smoke. That's what it smells like. Well, my nose is very fucked up, so it could be something completely different. Carbon monoxide poisoning anyone? <laughs> That's always fun. Well, at least it's a painless death, because you just slowly fall asleep and you never wake back up. So, I, I mean, it's like, if I had to choose a way to die, it'd probably be that, because at least it'd be painless. That's a kind of scary concept, though. Maybe, maybe I wouldn't choose that. How about just no ways to die? Thank you very much. I just pick no ways to die, if that's an option. Uh... Anyways, I'm just rambling on at this point. I've decided that I am going to take a break. And... Well, probably not too big of a break. Because, again, I have to do all this again before 3. So... You know, I'm going to have to get my mojo back. Hopefully. So, I'll probably... Well, try to be back as quick as possible, at least. So, we're not wasting too much time so we can get this done so we can actually go and live stream something else. Again, I'm not saying that I'm never going to live stream ExoZombies ever again. Just not as frequently as I've been doing it. Because, again, that's all I've been doing is ExoZombies because I've just been busting my ass trying to get this done. So, like I said, we only have one more gun to do. Which, well, it's, uh, I don't know, actually. It's not going to be the easiest. It's going to be the easiest means of surviving, of course, because it's just going to fucking plow through everything. Uh, and again, it's like, I learned that it actually is a pretty good point builder if you know how to use it for those purposes. 
I was completely fucking drop dead wrong about it being hard because it's not a point builder because I learned that it is, surprisingly enough. Uh, the only hard part is going to be getting it. That's going to be the part that's going to suck. And then trying to keep it throughout the entire thing as I'm calling in a rescue. And again, I'm not going to say it's an Easter egg because I don't believe it's an Easter egg. But again, to each their own. You know, I'm not going to make fun of people for calling it an Easter egg because that's just not the right thing to do. Anyways, we only have one more gun to do. If we are able to pull it off next game we do, then we will be able to live stream something else. Probably not straight after the game we do because it'll probably be like 2 or 3 in the morning. So I'm probably just going to go to bed afterwards. I don't know. I'll have to see what happens. But I will be doing another game before 3. Again, probably within the next 10-15 minutes or so. Probably longer than that if I do want to get something to eat. Because it'll take like 5 minutes to preheat the oven. At least 12 minutes to cook it. You know, about 5 minutes to eat it. You know, probably not 5 minutes. But I mean, you get the point. That that in and of, that in and of itself is going to take at least 20 minutes. But anyways, I will be back at some given point. It's time for this train wreck to end. I think it's been going on long enough. I'm just rambling on at this point. Okay.